If you're killing people, you are the criminal. We know the Hu Jintao is a killer of the Tibet. Already, this is the second time killing your Tibetan people. We all know that. So, 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 Today, your protests not only represent your Tibetans and also represent all Chinese people. But it also represents the whole world of human rights. All the people are love peace. All the people are love freedom. So, so you are the pioneer of the whole world of people. The whole world of people will support your people to the final success. The after the communist regime 
the whole world finally will get into the peace. I'm congratulations of everybody. Finally, you will be succeed. Long live. You know, uh, we know what the truth is. We know what's happening in Tibet. It doesn't matter what China says when you know the truth. It doesn't matter how many lies are spread when you know the truth. It doesn't matter what people do as long as you speak the truth, you stand for the truth, and you stand for justice. And that's what Tibetans do. I had uh, the honor of tabling a resolution a couple of weeks ago that was a sister resolution to MP Peggy Nash's in Ottawa. And the resolution said, please, all we are asking is that China negotiate with His Holiness the Dalai Lama. That's all we are asking. Now, Peggy is in Ottawa and she sends her regrets, but she, along with others, has started a parliamentary Friends of Tibet. I now, at Queen's Park, have started an Ontario Friends of Tibet. So, and we will be coming to join you at the Chinese consulate within the next two weeks. A group of MPPs will come and join you. But I want to say, that we are so proud of you. All of Ontario is watching. All of Canada is watching. The whole world is watching. And the whole world is so proud of you. You who sit and work and struggle and demonstrate in our midst, we are so profoundly aware of you and proud of you. We love you. You show us what freedom looks like. You show us what justice looks like. You show us what non-violent struggle looks like. You show us all of this. And I am so proud that I have the largest group of Tibetans living in my riding outside of Nepal. I can't tell you how you have changed my riding. So I just bring you greetings of love and greetings of compassion and greetings of comradeship. You know, we are with you. You are not alone. The whole world is watching. Everyone who cares about justice, everyone who cares about peace, everyone who cares about nonviolence is with the Tibetan people today. And always and ever until your children go back to a free Tibet. Thank you, and again, keep on. Please never give up hope. Never give up hope, because you know that truth will always win. It's just a matter of time, and time is on your side. Tyrants always fall, and China is a tyrant. And justice and democracy always win if you give it time, and you struggle for it, and you pray for it, and you demonstrate for it, and you fast for it. Thank you, Tibet. Free Tibet! Free Tibet.